fucking line called proactive policing and just nosy policing. That was nosy policing. And to, to merge on the freeway, you gotta merge on it. Do you not see the other drivers? Look at that dead guy over there. Hello everyone, welcome back to DOJ. Today we are getting in here as a taxi cab driver. We are gonna be doing that. It's been a while since we've actually done that. I'm going to eat some food from the back of my car really quick because we are about to die. Hold on, so let's get some water. I stocked up yesterday and I went and I got a whole bunch of tacos and water. So we should be good on that aspect. There's a cop that's been over the whole time. So I just started digging in my hood to kind of keep it normal looking, I guess you could say. So let's go ahead and put out a few ads here. We're going to go Doom and then go Taxi, Cab, Available. Uh, let's see. Uh, in all of the states. Yellow cab. Go. Oh, bam. And then that way they can put it in the chat and see if uh, I, they need a taxi cab or something like that. So yeah, we haven't done this in a while and I think it uh, should be pretty fun. Maybe some people might commit crimes and use a taxi cab and we will be the driver. So we can do some like crazy taxi type of thing where we drive hella reckless if that's what they want. But we're going to pull away from this cop because he's just been chilling here pretty much the whole time. So... Turn in game chat on and off and back on again. Nope, that's not to me. Okay, looks like he's still just chilling there. So I'm not sure what that cop's doing there. It's like he's stalking the taxi cab driver. So I made this a little different. I put the Crown Victoria rims on, but with no hubcaps. Kind of switch it up a little, make it look like it's a older style cab. We kind of look like uh, Nico from GTA 4. I don't know what the hell's going on right now, but... Uh, Pretty legit, pretty legit. So we're just gonna kind of drive around. Uh, I'm gonna go get gas probably. And we'll see if anyone hits us up for a taxi cab ride. Probably try to get some gas. Let's see here. Let me see where the nearest gas station is. We're gonna have to drive pretty legit when there's not a passenger in the vehicle that I wanna get fucked with. I think the nearest one is just down here. So yeah, we'll just want we'll to kind of keep it legit until we get a passenger. Then it's up to the passenger's discretion whether or not they want me to drive fast enough. And I think it would be interesting to get pulled over by a cop while driving like that and then just totally blame it on the passenger and see if they cut me a break because the passenger was so demanding. I, I mean, it's just one of those things. I would be interested to see how exactly this plays out. Looks like I'm doing good though. Not much people in the city. So if we do need to do a little bit of crazy taxi shit, it's not gonna disturb anyone. Or hopefully we don't get in trouble either way. Jesus, this is the longest light. What the fuck are we doing here? Okay, we're about a half a mile away from the gas station. Kind of the one just outside Grove Street. Just go ahead and cut me off, because that's okay. I'm cool with that. You fucking prick. I'll be like the taxi cab driver we saw in San Francisco. A complete jackass. All right, we're going to do some shit here. These lights are taking way too long. Way too long, so we're going to do some pretty illegal shit. Or a taxi cab driver, though. If they don't do dumb shit, then no one does. Simple as that. I want to just get to the gas station. That way we are able and open to receive calls if one comes through, if that might be the case. I also need to get videos done because we are going out to uh, Nevada probably to pick up fireworks. I'm not picking up fireworks. One of my buddies is. Uh, but might as well take the time to vlog, get some sick shots of the car in the desert, all that fun shit. So I want to try to get videos done, just get a little more ahead. I'm good till Friday technically with this video, even though you're not going to see it till God only knows when. Uh, but yeah, being ahead on videos definitely helps with all the new projects that I'm putting on my plate, like the vlogs and shit like that. So definitely good. I'm going to run this fucking light. Oh, it's so lucky it gave me a green light. It's weird that this car doesn't sound like the Crown Vic. You would think that they would put the Crown Vic mods down like they have for the other CVPIs in the game for this one, but I guess, hey, might as well leave the taxi cab out of it. Might as well. So now that we got gas, we should be good to just kind of go around and wait and hopefully someone needs a taxi cab. If not, fuck, I'm gonna go out there and I'm gonna have to do some jank shit to get by as a taxi cab driver if no one wants a fucking ride. Oh, it looks like someone just said, anyone got a number for the taxi cab? Uh, we're just gonna use universal chat. Cab service. Oh, fuck him. I'll just give him... I don't want to... 
fucking click that button because it usually fucks up the chat and it does a whole bunch of other shit. So my number is 53187. Okay, taxi. Yeah. I'd rather not, but I will just to fucking play along. That way it comes through the cell phone like an actual dispatch. I'd rather just go through the chat. It'd be easier because then I could just turn the chat off and we don't have to get double rides and shit. You know what I mean? So get the fuck out of the way. So I'm going to go probably hang out just uh, at these apartments back here from Grove Street. Just these ones right here. It'll probably be the best place for me to attack and not get robbed while I'm sitting and waiting for someone to hit me up. Okay, so it looks like we got our first taxi cab thing. It's a uh, taxi needed along Interstate 1 north of Vinewood Park down south drive, uh, down Vinewood Park Drive southbound lane. Okay. This one's definitely going to be interesting. I have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. Interstate 1 north of Vinewood Park. Okay. At least I can keep the phone up and do that. Let's see here. Uh, Interstate 1. This is Interstate 1 north. Of uh, Vinewood Park. Okay, there it is. Vinewood Park Drive. Okay, right there. Southbound. So they're heading on the right side. Right here. Yeah. What the fuck? You alright, sir? Uh, yeah. Why wouldn't I be alright? Uh, you're just sitting here in the alley. Yeah, I'm a taxi cab, cab driver there. waiting for a call. That's. We gotta sit somewhere. Like shit, dude. Yep, understandable. All right, you have a good I'm one. Make sure you're safe, cause it is a pretty bad part of town. I'm good, bro. Like shit, dude. They, the pro, they're like, there's a line. There's a fucking line called proactive policing and just nosy policing. That was nosy policing. I am totally cool. I'm a fucking taxi cab driver. These are lone sharks out here, dude. Out to make money and get with it. If you know what I mean. I don't know what I mean. So yeah, that's just one of those things. I don't know why. I don't know why they do that. So we have somewhere to go at this point. So we're going to turn around here. I'm a taxi cab driver. I got to sit somewhere like, and of course the one spot I do sit, a motherfucking cop wants to come up and fucking, y'all right? Like, God damn it. If the dude is out in the middle of nowhere, maybe has like drool coming out of his mouth and is slumped over sideways in the seat, or maybe he looks like this, I'd ask him if he's all right. That's like my classic go-to, I'm passed out, inebriated, and or some type of shit that's going on right now. But yeah, I mean, this I'm the farthest thing that should be questioned or anything. A taxi cab driver in a big-ass yellow and blue taxi cab. You got me fucked up, dude. Shit. Now I know he's gonna be around here somewhere, because I just saw him leave that alleyway back there. And I really don't know where he's at, so... I mean, I can kind of run red lights and stuff when we don't have a passenger, but as soon as we get the passenger, it's going to have to be discretion to the fucking passenger. I just really want to go. If that car across from me goes, I'm going to pretend like I have a green, too. Well, there is not a single soul at this light. Okay, fuck this. Oh, no. <gasps> oh, the bike got pulled over. Thank God, because I just ran a red light as that happened. Thank the Lord, dude. Okay, he's occupied. Clear my rights. Clear my left. We're good. Might as well keep up our... We gotta get to the passenger as fast as we can because there's Uber, there's Lyft, there's other shit like that that's going on in this world that takes away from my business, goddammit. Alright. Oh my god, family has died. Alright, I just gotta get onto the one here past all these lights and shit and we should be good. Clear left. Clear right. Clear straight. That's how you do it. You gotta clear your lefts, rights, and straights. This one you could just kind of run through. Everyone runs through that one. This one is a little more sketchy though. Then again, who patrols over here? Fucking Lost Boys, that's who patrols over here. We're gonna fuck through it. Can't stop me. Watch this one time. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Pull over, motherfucker. I'm like, honestly upset at this car sound noise because it doesn't sound like the Vic and it just sounds like I'm driving like a normal ass car when I know I'm driving a Vic. Fucking with my mind. Okay, so we're on the freeway that the individual taxi cab driver, or no, I am. Uh, the taxi cab. Uh, rider, that's what you want to say. The tag cab rider should be in these lanes on the freeway southbound lane, so we're gonna need to turn around. Don't go too fast, Sparky. Uh, southbound lanes. I'm not exactly sure. I would think he's across from Vinewood Bowl. We'll have to, or not Vinewood Bowl, Vinewood Park Drive. I'm not entirely sure though. Let's see.
So I would assume he would be here, but I'm not. Or maybe he's over there. On Vinewood Park Drive. Or would he say across from? Let me, I'm going to just get a postal. That way I know. I mean, uh, without a postal, it's just too fucking difficult. Taxi needed a long Interstate 1. I was just at Interstate 1, so I don't want to do an illegal as you turn on Interstate 1 here. Oh, I see him right there. I see him. That has to be them. Whoa, dude. You don't just slam on the brakes. And I'm going to get pulled over for probably nothing. What the fuck, dude? What the fuck? Are you serious? I'm getting pulled over? What the fuck for? Because I'm getting on the freeway? That's fucking retarded. Absolutely retarded. Well, the vehicle's not registered me. It's fucking... It's a taxi cab, so I'm not going to spend the time registering it. Fuck that shit. That is the second time I've been pulled over getting on the freeway for some bullshit. They just get so happy over that. It's not even funny. I just have to get a character name. Let's see. Who am I going to use? We'll use... I'll use Daryl Dover. What is he doing? The fuck is he doing? What the hell is going on over here? Nope. 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 Well, you merged onto the interstate. How do you merge like that? Then you switch lanes as soon as you cross the Well, yeah, you're allowed to cross and merge into an interstate. <laughs> not like that. Oh, yeah, you, you absolutely so can merge. You don't need to signal. That's not in the buy code. You don't need to signal. I read that because I'm a taxi cab driver. I don't need to signal. And to, uh, to merge on the freeway, you gotta merge on it. Do you not see the other drivers? Look at that dead guy over there. That's the type of drivers I'm driving around. I'm over here trying to pick up this dude. I'm lost as hell as it is. I'm merging onto the freeway. I gotta do what I gotta do. Oh, well, you rushed on there too collectively. That's why I'll stop you. Well, that's not what you originally said at first. You said I'm stopping you because of the way you merged on the freeway, and then now you're saying it's the speed? Whoa, whoa. I think I said that the first time. No, you said that the, you just walked up and said I'm stopping you because of the way you merged on the freeway and then you moved over into the other lane. Exactly. But that's not speed. That's not, I didn't do anything wrong on that. <laughs> I gotta clear this traffic. Oh my god, why is it doing that? So <laughs> this guy's just playing it off like nothing. I need driver license and registration for the insurance of the vehicle. Yep, my name's Daryl Dover. There's all my information. I don't think I did anything wrong, but all right, I will sit here and play along with the bullshit. As all these fucking well, people. I told you what you said. Yeah, but you, you all you said was the way you merged onto the freeway and changed lanes. There's nothing wrong with what you just said. That's not a violation to merge onto the freeway and change lanes. Speeding also? What, what was my speed? The traffic. I can clock your speed. So then how would you know I'm speeding? Also, if you have to get onto a freeway to be able to merge onto a freeway, you need to maintain the same speed of the people traveling on the freeway or a little bit greater to make it safer. Yo. Going... You didn't yield though. What do you mean? I don't need to yield. I'm getting on the freeway. How does someone that's getting on the freeway need to yield? The people that are in the lane need to be able to yield to the person getting on the freeway too. It's a it's a two-way game. It's not just a one-way. I can't control what someone else does. Sorry, sit tight for me. Okay, we're gonna get a supervisor out to this one, because this guy is not really understanding, I guess, driving. This simple confines of just having to drive and get onto a freeway 
you have to be going the same speed or a little bit greater to be able to fucking get on, I say it, like a freeway safe, like straight up. The fuck am I just like over here driving for the first time? Nope. I wish I could just live rewind just so I could see it really quick again because my maneuvers getting onto the freeway were legit in my mind because I'm over there trying to look at the other side of the freeway looking for my person I have to pick up and shit. It's like, I don't know. Fucking shit. All sack. All right, there's your information back. Gonna be issuing a warning today. All right. Because he has no evidence. All right, I mean, yeah, I, don't, I didn't think there was a ticket that could be given anyways because I didn't do anything wrong. I mean, shit, dude. Oh, you didn't yield, all right? And you're speeding like that coming onto a freeway. I don't understand what you mean by you're speeding like that coming onto a freeway. If you're on a, if you're entering a freeway, you need to be able to speed up. How does that not make any sense? <laughs> like, what the fuck? There is like no such thing as speeding onto a freeway because you need to speed up to get onto the freeway. <laughs> I mean, if, if I'm if I'm lost in this, go ahead. We I'll wait for a supervisor just so we can clear it up. Do you want to request one? No, I'm saying if you're lost on this, we can request a supervisor just to clear this up. No, I'm not lost. Okay, so then we uh, come to an understanding that uh, you have to at least go a certain speed or faster. You have to accelerate to get onto the freeway. <laughs> like, shit. Well, yeah, but not that fast. How fast was I going? That doesn't back. make sense. If I'm paying attention to the other side of the road so I can pick up the taxi cab person that I have to pick up, I'm doing multiple things at once. I'm merging onto the freeway. People are also driving on that freeway. I need to speed up to get to the same speed they're going. I mean, it's, I'm, I'm a little confused, like... If I was not maintaining my lanes because I was looking on the other side of the freeway, I'd be like, yeah, you're damn right, that's that's not good, I need to pay attention. <laughs> well, do you have any more questions as we end this traffic stop? No, I'm good. Alright, have a good one. Have a good one. Okay, so I just got stopped from this guy. I don't, I don't know. I'm debating whether or not I even want to show it because it was just so utterly ridiculous. I was, I was pretty much arguing with them that he was like, what is that noise? Oh, I just changed the radio station. Basically, he was like, yeah, you were going too fast on the on-ramp and then you just cut over and it's like, I'm sorry, you have to accelerate to be able to go forward. You know what I mean? You have to be able to accelerate at the same... Oh, fuck, I took the wrong freeway. You have to be able to accelerate to get either at the same speed or a speed close to what everyone's traveling on the freeway. It just didn't make sense. And then he gave me a warning for everything, and it's just like, ah, I could tell you didn't know that you could get in anything because it's you wouldn't just give a warning if there was actual impeding evidence against someone doing something. Oh, it was a little bit of frustrating right there. So that's why we just got to get to this guy. It's been so long. I feel so horrible. But uh, now he's behind me again. Are you fucking serious, dude? How did he get all the way over to the left lane and then get all the way over to the right lane? That just doesn't make any sense. Okay, I don't know how that person got in between us. But I've got to try to figure out a way to get over to the fucking other freeway. I am so lost. It's not even funny. Why is he following me? What the hell? That doesn't make any sense. I'm over here just trying to live my life and shit, trying to be a taxi cab driver, and I get fucked with. I love when I do legit shit, I get fucked with. It just doesn't even make sense. Now he's not gonna make it so I can't fucking do a U-turn here, even though I need to do a U-turn here, or I'm just gonna get so far away that it's gonna be just, I might as well call another taxi cab driver. What the fuck are you doing? Are you fucking serious? What, oh my God, are you doing? What is this? What are you doing? This is fucking absurd. Why the fuck is he pulling me over again? Same motherfucker, after just letting me go and I drive away, go on two different freeways, I get motherfucking pulled over again. This better be fucking good. Okay, here comes the cop. I have literally no idea what this is for. My driving after that traffic stop was fucking pristine. Fucking pristine. Oh, so how are you doing? Uh, yeah. I don't know why I'm stopped here. I'd love to hear it, though. Well, uh, back in the connection where the Interstate 1 and uh, US Route 15 connect, I caught 
clocked you, I believe I clocked you 88 miles per hour when you're taking that turn. That's impossible. Literally impossible. From the time I just got off my last traffic stop, dude, I was driving so perfect. I don't know how that's even possible. It, it came on my uh, radar. It beeped, so... Okay, well then write me a ticket then. Fuck this, dude. Like, what the fuck? Can I just get your uh, license registration insurance? Yep, Daryl Dover. I think... Wait here, wait here, sir. Well, I just got pulled over for speed. I guess I was going 88 miles per hour. I don't fucking remember going 88 miles per hour, so I don't know what the fuck this is. I mean, you got me fucked up right now. Yeah, I'm here. So anyways, okay, so anyway, I'm just gonna be issuing you a verbal warning. Just uh, do me a favor, just uh, drive safe. I was just reviewing my dash cam footage and I uh, the max speed that I went was either 67 or 70 something. I never went 80 something. So who you thought was going 80 was not me. Oh, my apologies, sir. And um, I'll be uh, checking the radar, you know, uh, seeing if there's any problem with it. So um, sorry about the time, sir. Um, have a good day. All right, have a good one. Okay, I literally just stopped my recording just to check if I did go fast, as he said, and I did not, because I knew I didn't. I knew I didn't. They're fucking with my head, man. They're, they're making me want to go crazy right now. Fuck, dude. Psychological fucking profiling. I don't know how they're doing it, and it's just now new, but they are fucking with me, dude. Holy shit. So I have multiple people that need taxi cab drivers. All I've been doing is just been harassed by every fucking cop on the map, so that's just fucking fantastic. He's probably gonna get me for an illegal U-turn. I just need to get to these fucking people. They just need a goddamn pickup. I'm out here living the life as a motherfucking person, and I keep getting fucked with. It doesn't make any sense, dude. Oh my god. Okay, so I just let this guy know I was getting harassed pretty much the whole time trying to get there as a legit taxi cab driver. You know what they say. I don't know. I've got to look back at that at the first footage too about me merging onto the freeway. To my knowledge, it didn't seem that aggressive, but I don't know. To one's his own. I don't even know if that's a saying. So we're going to get on to the freeway here. Our first pickup is going to be just down here. I got to get onto the freeway without doing some jank shit. There we go. So he should just be down here, right on the exit. It's the first guy we saw. I don't even know if he's gonna be there anymore. I wouldn't be there if I was this fucking late, too. I'd be like, fuck taxi cab drivers. I'm calling an Uber up in this bitch. Oh my god. Come on. All we have to do is get to that location. I think I still see the cops and shit. Okay, you know what? I gotta get through like this. Oh, he's still there. All right, man, sorry about that. They kept harassing me. God damn it. Oh, you're good, dude. Fucking traffic's been blowing up out here. Yeah, it's pretty crazy right now. Okay, first guy of the night. Let's see. Oh, that sounded bad. Oh, okay, that's not Holy a road. Holy shit. Where are you headed? I was gonna go to the city, but I'm thinking of Sandy Shores gas station now. Yeah, that'd be great, because I gotta go to Yellow Jack. Let me just uh, message this other person. Hold on. Let's see, messages... Yes, on the way. Okay, then I got two other people that need to be picked up at the uh, prison. So we got to uh, go ahead and head to... What's going on with your car? Are they keeping it there? Are you getting it towed or...? I mean, I tried to get a hold of a tow, but nobody ever responded back on that. I had a couple of police officers stop by, but one apparently decided to send them to the heavens there. Oh, that's always good. Yeah, damn head gasket blew on me. Which is freaking nice, because I just bought it for about $1,400 a few days ago. Oh, damn, that's a bummer. Not as bad as me getting harassed every fucking corner I turn. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, I mean, you might if there's a cop next to us. So. Oh, yeah, that's probably one of them that pulled me over. Motherfuckers. Saying I was merging too fast. I'm gonna merge the same yeah, exact the way. You know, so I learn to drive here, man. Yep. I mean, I could step it up for you if you want to get there fast. We might get pulled over again, but yeah, uh, shit, man. <laughs> I mean, I'll pay you extra. Okay. So I'm gonna merge onto the freeway. You got it. <laughs> like an actual taxi cab driver. So this is how I merge. About 51. 
And then I got over probably again like that. Boom, just like that. But there was no one in my way. Oh, what the hell is oh, going shit. on? Everyone's dead over there. We're gonna do some jank shit right here. God, this car is so slow, dude. It is so slow. Come on, buddy. Come on, there we go. Breaking the gap. Breaking the gap. Oh! Woo! We're out here in the Vic, though. <laughs> I'd be so scared if I was in a taxi cab with me. Okay, these guys are going way too fast. They're in the slow lane. That guy's car's about to break down and die. Gotta love it. So yeah, he wants to go to the Yellow Jack. I might as well just stop at the prison really quick and pick up uh, those two people that need to be picked up. They just got out of jail. Poor man. Oh, about two years now. Is it alright if we stop at the prison and pick up uh, two other people? <laughs> yeah, man, go ahead. Sounds good. So yeah, hopefully traffic breaks up here. We can get through this shit. No, uh police officers wanted to stop our grind or anything like that. Like, we didn't even get to the first person before we got fucked with. Like, what the hell? Jesus. I don't know, it's like, when you when you are in a taxi cab, you just stand out. You have a bright-ass yellow and blue car, and it's like, oh, notice me, everything I'm doing. It's like, you know, it shouldn't be like that. It shouldn't be to the point where I, like, I do one little, like, GTA hiccup where, like, the steering is all fucked because it's like a joystick I'm driving with and it's I'm getting pulled over like that shit was back there. That was jank. That was illegal. Oh shit. That was illegal, but uh, you know, I don't know. Just one of those things. Why stop if I've already ran through it, huh? That's the philosophy we should keep on everything. Okay, we've got to stop at the prison really quick, which we're actually almost at the prison. That's right over there to the left. I'm not sure where they're going, but we'll drop this guy off first so that way he can get where he needs to go since he's literally waited the whole time I've started. Since I've sent out that message, that dude was sitting there waiting. I fucking caramba. Get out of the way. Alright, let's head down this way. This is looking good. Oh shit. I wish this- I'm gonna pump up the, uh... This thing should just be faster. It's so fucking slow. It's ridiculous. Okay, here we go. And I got too many memories here. Yeah, don't we all? Here they are. I got another passenger, but you guys can hop in after I drop him off in Sandy. Oh, shit. You're right. You hop on in. Fucking Sam's like You're dead. Right, Alright, where are you guys going, just so I know? We're going down to our home, uh, which is down in the Vinewood Hills there, mate. Vinewood oh, Hills, perfect. We'll hit this. All right, as soon as we Man, go to Sandy. Them before me. Yeah, well, you were what well, you were waiting longer. They weren't waiting as long, I'll tell you that. <laughs> so we're in Sandy. You said the twenty-four-seven. Uh, Sandy Shores gas station there. Okay, the, uh, perfect. Station. That's the twenty-four-seven. But yep, that works. Take some back roads. Maybe well, I can smack. Like yeah, well, I'm deaf, so I can't hear any music. Where's Shane? Yep, unfortunately, if I uh, play music, uh, people don't like it if you say that. Just say I get I get uh, content ID up in this bitch. <laughs> so, like, <laughs> like... Honestly, I think they're listening to music in their head. I mean, shit, I wish I could. But so, music, real music, so much better. I miss it. <laughs> like... <laughs> the one luxury I never got in this game was listening to music. Never, ever got that. And when you bring in those front street boys, it's so nice. I mean, shit, I would like some, uh... I don't even know the radio stations. I never look at them. And some, uh, Tom oh, Rollins. Do what me and Mary do. We put our own music in, and we put it in an MP3 player and connect it to the car radio. And oh. Something like that. Yeah, that's actually one. All, all yeah. NCS right. songs. That way it's not illegal. There you go. <laughs> like, Alright, guys. That'll, uh, just... Uh, five bucks will do, that's fine. You guys even have five dollars? You guys just got out of jail. <laughs> like... No, we're I mean, not coming here, man. Right? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. well, that's right. That's right. Yeah, well, that, uh, yours would be... Let's just do 20. 20 is cool. Uh, ready? Give me one second. Yep. Nice and cheap. We make a living, but we're not dishonest. I like how the radio's still going. Come on.
Ow, I just totally hit my knee on yeah, my microphone. Yeah, I think his passenger took it from me, actually. Oh, well, that'll work. He'll just yeah, include he'll... it into the fare when I get it from him later. I appreciate it, sir. You have a good night. Yeah, man. I slid you uh, 50 for the uh, stepping up and everything. All right. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, don't let, let him jip you now. Oh, I won't. Adios. All right. We're going to get out there. Right. So you guys are going... Yeah, hey. it's your day thing, mate. Oh, so far so good. I've been harassed by the cops all day, and then I finally was able to pick up people. Oh, shit. Well, what do the pigs want, mate? Oh, merging too quickly well, onto a freeway, and then, uh, I guess one of them said I was speeding, but then I stopped and checked my dash cam footage, and I wasn't. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, the corrupt cops, mate. They're all over this, they're all over this county. I know. The corruptness. They just want to take you down. And by the way, I said thank you to Tommy. He just dropped off a plate of food. He didn't have to do that. But uh, that's why I said thank you to him. Aren't you, aren't you going to ask why we were at the jail there, mate? Oh, I'd not rather curious? not know. I mean, you're usually not supposed to ask someone in jail why they were in jail. What's this guy doing? I don't know. He was driving, so I pulled over. Is he done? Like... <laughs> Okay, I guess he needed to figure out where he was going. <laughs> like, shit, dude. I love those cars. They're sexy. Yeah, gotta love That's the shit I've been dealing with all day, is that shit. Just them going super antsy and antsed up crazy bullshit. Like, what the fuck? That's why I assault the cops, mate. That's what we were in jail for, by the way. Oh, assault Lord. Them. What'd you do? Shoot them? Beat them? Shit on them? No, just punch yeah, them. We just, we just bash them, mate. Well, that's one way to do it. God damn fucking prick we, we, drive. We would, we would never, we would never what is like, going on, shoot dude? a cop. I, I mean, I shot at their car to try and disable their tires, but that's it. Oh, shit. Oh, look how nervous you are, mate. Every time you see a cop, you pull over. Well, they're going you, lights and it, sirens. That's a law. They've been harassing you that much. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah, we I mean, never obey that, no. Well, we seriously. I mean, I, then again, look at them. They're driving on my side of the road. I don't want to ruin my taxi cab. They're driving like animals today. That's because they're farm animals. <laughs> Can there you guess which pigs. ones? Oh, pigs? Oh, there's one <laughs> yeah. smashing. They I think, be, I think um, there's one trailing us. Oh, oh literally right. just lit us up. What the fuck? See? I told you all day long. This has been it all day long, even though we're just driving like normal. Maybe just a little bit over at 74, but still, no nope. insta shutdown. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Let's see how you get into this one. I just tell him to write the ticket, because I hey. don't got time. <laughs> like, shit, like. Hey, you know Chester's the district manager for Yellow Cab Co., right? You know that? Well, that ain't gonna do shit yeah. when they keep pulling us over. I don't often get to see my drivers that much, because, you know, I'm always in the office. But it's nice to have you on board. Well, I'm glad you just got arrested and released from jail. Thanks. <laughs> hey, the press won't hear about this, will they? Oh, not unless they know about it. Oh, this is ridiculous. Yep, tell me about it. Story of my life. Hello, guys. Trooper Luke with the San Andreas High Patrol. How are you guys doing today? Yes, great. How's it going? Doing good. Uh, I stopped you for 75 and a 60, sir. Okie dokie, my name's uh, Daryl Dover. There's my registration, insurance, and all that. Okay, uh, where are you guys heading? I'm just dropping them off in Vinewood. Alright, you said Daryl Dover? Yep. Alright, as long as you guys check out all clear, uh, I'll let you guys get where you're going. I know you guys don't need any holdbacks getting where you're going. Are both of these guys your passengers? Yep. All right, sounds good. Mission Dover, I'll be right back with you. All right. No, I don't, the one in blue is actually his boyfriend. Nope. Oh, boy. <laughs> nope. How long you want to make this last, dude? You want to get there or you want to fucking take this forever? Because they're going to take forever if you want them to. I've been stopped. This is my third time today. Jeez. I never get stopped that much. Yeah, well, earlier, me and bloody Barry were on our... Uh, Pegasi Fangios on the side of the road, and we'll get an arrest. That's all it takes. There's a Fagio. Then everyone's going to jail. Oh, 
I mean, these bikes are pretty good. They're a bit slow, but man, they're bloody great. Did they impound the bikes? No. You <laughs> told them that they can't get us in trouble. You tell them, Barry. Tell oh, them. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, no, we were just uh, on the side of the road, minding our own business, and they, they pulled us over for, for riding on the shoulder, but we weren't even on the shoulder. We were, like, way off the road, mate. And so, anyway, um, we got off the bikes, and we bashed the officers and took off. But they oh, caught us. Oh, shit. <laughs> it was... Oh, hang on. <laughs> oh, hang on. Here's your stuff back. I appreciate your cooperation. Uh... Uh, you're in an awkward spot here. You're gonna have to reverse to get out of here. Um, I'm not gonna cite you. I'm not even gonna go through the time of writing you a warning. I want you to keep oh, good. going, okay? Um, so you guys have a good night. Whenever I turn off my lights, you're free to back up and pull back onto the highway. All right, I appreciate it. Thank you. No problem. Have a good night, guys. You too. You see, you bloody legend. <laughs> there it is. Seems legit. All right, at least we got off on this one without getting fucked with. Oh shit. That 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 guy was a bloody legend. Oh, there he goes. Oh, he's blocking it. Oh, is he even gonna let us in? That's nice. Yeah, it's nice to see get rammed. Like, what the fuck? Okay, let's just get there. I'm gonna F fucking cruise control this bitch. That way we're chilling. Oh, I just took a screenshot. You gotta love it. I'm all over the place. Had many I hate that it's today? 60. Nope, just uh, the other guy and you pretty much did. Yeah, when I look at the paperwork in the offices, we don't get a lot of business compared to bloody Uber. You know what I mean? It's 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 hard running downtown cab, mate. Yeah, yeah. Hard not to switch over. Make more money with Uber. I mean, I'm just literally on uh, cruise control, 58 to 59. That's great. The guy who actually runs yellow. It doesn't even know which one it is. Downtown cab, mate. Then you know what? I wouldn't be there. I'd be going to Uber. Yep, so would I, and this guy's riding our ass, come on. No wonder you have no headlights. So where exactly, uh, in, uh, Vinewood, or did you guys mark it on the GPS? Uh, it's, it's marked on the GPS for me, do you see it there, mate? Yep, I see it. I just had to take a bite of a chip, I'm so hungry, it's not even funny. I'm about to, like, die hungry, that's probably not a good, uh... A good, good combination there, but uh, I'm pretty fucking hungry. Oh, that was sneaky. You know it. Just like the stop sign. What stop sign? Oh shit! I didn't see no stop sign. Exactly. That's what we would say in court. It would hold up to it. Okay. I don't know. They're oh shit. They live far in Vinewood. Jesus Christ. That's like towards the end and shit. I wasn't expecting that. They're still like a mile away from us, which is. Pretty fucking far. Past my house, which we're gonna pass up here on, uh, what road is this? Wispy, no, North Conquer Ave, that's right. Okay, well at least we know there's no cops up here, so I can do some jank shit if I have to. What we're gonna do, but this thing's so slow, it's gonna be virtually impossible to do it. Now the crazy taxi's gonna begin. Oh, that's a fucking, that's a bike, stay off to the side of the road. The crazy taxi has begun, I, uh, we gotta speed this one up. Yeah, mate. That's your right, mate. You go. Just go as fast as you want, mate. We like fast cars. There it is. Two guys that are willing to go back to jail. God damn it. Out of the road, shit stain. I can't really go fast, because this car doesn't go fast. I kind of feel like I'm being cheated out of an experience here. Because even a fucking Crown Vic in real life is a little bit slow, but also still has a general feeling of speed to it. You know what I mean? Like, not like a dinosaur is trying to I run. Think this has been the best cab ride of my life, Chester. You know what I mean, there it is. That, that last cab driver from the other day, he was a bit of an idiot, mate. He smelled a bit funny too. Just here, mate. Just here, mate. Just oh. here. Oh. That's, uh, that's interesting. I live right down the street, so we'll see ya. <laughs> oh, damn, mate. Alright, how much is this gonna be? Because I've got to give you the $50 from the other guy. Uh, yeah, you guys could just do 35. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 75. Or 85, actually. Right. 85, right. Do you, can I type my card? Yep, I can swipe the card. Yeah, no. Yeah, Alright, let me just get my card out of my wallet here. Because you know every taxi cab driver has a swiper. I think they do Use though. Use your master visa, Chester. Master That's visa. The money on it, mate. 
There we go. Perfect. You have a good one now, mate. Thanks for the ride. Have a good one. Yeah, we'll take see you care later. You bloody legend. I sure yeah, will. See ya. What a what a bloody legend. All right, and that is what the taxi cab drive. I'm glad we were able to help two people out get to their location as quickly as we could. We did our thing. We did it right. And I got to admit, the best part about that, in general, dropping them off where we did is now I can just go home. <laughs> Literally, right down the fucking street. They're going to come out of their house and be like, oh, he lives there. Good. You gotta love it. But anyways, I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have to work with this episode a little. Probably do some editing and shit like that. Uh, but again, this is a little bit of- I would say quicker, even though it still ended up me sitting here for 55 minutes and 44 seconds raw for the video. It's not like I said raw like I was naked. Uh, just like, that's how long I've been recording this video. Um, you know, just so I could kind of do some other stuff. I'm, I have some other plans I got this week, but I still have content that's ready for you guys, ready to go out, so... Again, thank you guys so much for coming out and watching another episode. I love you all so much. You guys have got me where I'm at. And it's just a beautiful fucking, like, roller coaster of a ride we're going on right now with the vlogs and the content and the DOJ. And just being able to sit back and actually play roleplay for however long of time and just kind of enjoy it. And, you know, it's it's all good. And, you know, sharing it with you guys is just the just icing on the cake up in this bitch. So thank you guys so much for uh, coming out and watching another video. And we will see you next episode.